everyone knows that there's some crazy virus going around at the moment and um, everybody's buying like lots of toilet paper but everyone's also buying hand sanitizer because alcoholic hand sanitizer is able to kill this virus and and today I'm going to show you how to make some alcoholic hand sanitizer. Now it has to be alcoholic based and it needs to be a minimum of 60%. Now I'm going to make it slightly higher today just to be sure. The alcohols that I see recommended are like isopropyl and one of them is also ethanol. Now where do you get ethanol from? Well, methylated spirits is actually 95% ethanol. It's almost pure alcohol. The alcohol is quite effective against the virus. Now, what's going to protect your skin? Well, you need to have a gel, and I'm going to get the gel from a wonderful plant called aloe vera. Now, aloe vera is a succulent, and it's great for if you get sunburn, you apply the, the gel to your skin. It's got vitamin E, vitamin C, but it will also mix with, it will mix with the alcohol, it will form a moisture layer gel, a moisture layer gel on your skin that will help protect your skin uh, from the alcohol and from drying out. So, how are we going to extract this um, gel? Well, I don't want any of the, I don't really want the green surface, and so I've never actually done this before. Oh, there we go. Look, I've got a potato peeler. And uh, I'm going to peel, I'm going to peel off the outer green layer. Here we go. Pull it towards me. Oh, very good. I'm going to blend it up. Okay, I'm going to blend up the guts of it. So let me get this gel. This is good. Oh, it's so gooky though. Gooky, gooky, gooky. Aha. Aha. Yay. This is, wow. This is fantastic. Look at this. Look, look at this, this clear gel. In you go. Bloop. Oh, it's a bit like um, filleting a fish, actually. Woohoo! Oh! Aha! Beautiful. Look, you can see the knife. <laughs> knife going through it. Clear, colourless, goopy. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. See? It's protecting my skin already. It's my daughter's blender. Apparently you can eat aloe vera. Oh! Goop it down here. Pop it in. And... It's frothing up. Okay. So, now, let's take the lid off. And... No, I'm not going to drink it. Some type of smoky steam's coming off. So, ooh, look at that. Now, a lot of that's air. A lot of that's air. There we go. I've got my 60% alcohol. Probably a bit more. Okay, that's helped the bubbles go out of it. And I'm going to fold it. Fold it around. And I'm, going, I'm going to put it into a. I'm going to put it into a sauce bottle that I put in some boiling water and some soap, and then rinsed it, and then some more soap and that sort of thing. But I might do one more. Might just a couple of drops and shake it around like this, and just get my matches. Oh, woo! Okay, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> That's sterilized. In goes my hand sanitizer. Look, 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 look. Great, wonderful. And now I'll put on my lid. And look at this. Oh. That feels, feels wonderful. That feels really good. A bit more. Okay. So now, I've 
Got my very own virus stopper. Hmm. It smells <coughs> alcoholic. Probably because it is alcoholic. Bring it here. S. What's an S look like? Woo! Let's join up. And are we ready? Let's pop that there. Let's light this bad boy up. Woo! And here comes the flame. Might even get it going from this end as well. Zip! Zip! Alright. And. Oh! Virus! Virus killer! <laughs> Woo! Woo! And that, my friends, is how you make your own hand sanitizer. It's not bad, actually.